Hey, this is Joe with Moultrie Mobile, and I'm here today to talk to you about managing and adjusting your filters and smart tag notifications within the Moultrie Mobile app. All right, guys, now that you've got your app downloaded, your camera's active, and you're getting a lot of pictures, I want to show you how you can filter down your images. So maybe you're getting a lot and you really just want to see specific things. I'm going to show you how to do that today in the app. So once you're logged in, you're going to take your filter icon, hit that, and this will bring up all of the different options that you have to filter your images. So I'm just going to touch on a couple of those today. So for instance, the top one, you can select camera and you can choose individual cameras to see images only from that particular camera. So you also have smart tags. Moultrie Mobile includes AI software, which will identify when it notices a certain attribute, such as if it's a deer, a buck, doe, turkey, vehicle, or person. So you can filter down by those specific things. Moving on down, when you see media, what that allows you to do is filter by your high-res images, videos, or thumbnails. You can select time of day. I know a lot of you guys hunt by moon phase religiously, so you can select by certain moon phases. Also temperature, a certain date range, say if you know the rut happens at a particular time in your area, you can select by a certain date range. Um, day or night images, so many different things. You've got a whole host of options here for you. I'm going to show you just a couple. So for instance, if I wanted to see just bucks, I would go to my smart tags, select buck, and let's say I just wanted to see images that I had selected that I wanted high res. Go to media, high res, and then I would apply those two filters and it will filter to just those images. So one important thing to note is when you want to go back to your main gallery, you're going to go to your filter and you're going to need to hit clear. This will clear any filters that you have set. You would apply and go back to your main gallery page. One other pretty cool feature is that once you have a, a search that you've um, put in place, you can actually save that search and name it so you don't have to go back and reapply that same search over and over. It will be there saved for you. So that's just a few little tips there for you with Moultrie Mobile. We really encourage you to get in there, play with the filters, really fine tune your hunting and your scouting efforts using Moultrie Mobile. For more information or to reach out to us, click the support icon in your Moultrie Mobile app or visit us at MoultrieMobile.com.